sit comfortably. Check your spine straight. Check your hands in Chin Mudra, Nyan Mudra. Close your eyes. Make any comfortable meditative asana, Padmasana, Vajrasana, Partha Padmasana. Is there any asana? Close your eyes. Just listen your body and breathing. Feel the complete relaxation from toes to top of the head. Completely relax. Slowly take aware on your breathing. Just listen your natural incoming and outgoing breath. Slowly take long, breathe in and breathe out. Inhale, feel the expansion of your stomach. Exhale, feel the contraction of your stomach. Inhale, take deep inhalation. Exhale, make the complete exhalation. Feel the movement of air in your body. Inhale, feel the inhalation of love and prosperity. Exhale completely, feel the complete exhaling of all your negative emotion, disease, pain. Inhale love and prosperity, exhale ego and all your negative emotions. Chant the prayer, deep inhalation and arm chanting. Imagine your favorite guru or god in front of your clothes. Inhale. Interlock your fingers, stretch your hands, shake your body, open your chest, inhale and exhale, bend down and ride your arms up. Inhale, slowly take your body up and relax yourself. Just relax, listen your body and breathing. Feel the complete calmness of your body and breathing. Just move to the nostrils cleaning. 
forceful exhalation. Take your hands in Adi Mudra, fold your thumb finger and fold your four fingers. Oh, no. This one, uh, the first thumb, then four. Yes. And forceful exhalation. So tap your armpit. That helps to balance your nostril passages, your nadis. Yourself. <coughs> Open your palms, just close your eyes, relax your whole body, feel the complete calmness of your body and breathing. Feel the complete calmness of your body and breathing. Slowly take deep inhalation and exhalation. When you have to inhale, slowly take deep inhale and exhale. So just feel and watch your body. It's the state of Kevala Kumpaka. The holding, the energy flow is automatically happens in our body without inhalation and exhalation. Now slowly take deep inhale and exhale. Inhale, feel the expansion of your stomach. Exhale, feel the contraction of your stomach. Your belly should move towards your spine. Completely relax yourself. So today completely we are going to concentrate on our chest region, the lung opening stretches and lung opening exercises, the strong back bends or uh, back stretches that helps to give opening for your chest and your lungs. Also the strong back stretches helps to give good uh, stretchings for your spinal cord. Okay. Completely relax your whole body. Let's start the beautiful stretch, the Parvatasan. From sitting, open your hands, exhale completely. Inhale, rise your arms up, pull your body up. And exhale, slowly drop your hands down. Inhale, keep your chest open. And exhale, combine your breathing and the movement. Inhale up, feel the complete stretching and opening. Exhale down, not only pulling your uh, shoulder, just stretch your whole body, the torso part. Inhale, that gives good energy flow for your rib cages and the regions. Exhale. Now with breath holding, inhale up, hold your breath, take your hands in Namaskar, 3, 2, 1. Exhale, slowly drop your hands down. Now the second round, inhale, hold your breath, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and exhale. Relax yourself, relax completely. Now let's move to the side stretch by giving the complete stretch to our side hips and the side stomach and lung region. Open your hands, exhale completely. Yes, just touch your fingers down. Inhale and exhale. While exhaling, stretch complete side, side hips. Inhale, so here not only the stretch, just pull your body up, exhale, stretch here. Inhale, pull your right up and exhale. 
Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Last one. Inhale and exhale. And inhale, relax. Relax yourself. Take deep inhalation and exhalation. Now move to the side stretch with Anthar Kumpaka, the inhalation and holding. Interlock your fingers, stretch your hands above your head and take your hand back of your ears. Inhale, pull your body up and slowly, gently stretch your body on your side. Feel the complete opening of your chest and the side hips area. Two, three, four, five. Inhale up. And exhale, stretch. Sorry. Inhale and stretch. Hold your breath. Inhale. Hold and stretch. Inhale. Hold and stretch. Inhale and relax. Relax yourself completely within your body and breathing. Take deep inhalation and exhalation. Now the next one. So sit in Vajrasana or the cow pose, Gomukhasana. So we are going to practice the Gomukhasana stretch. So slowly take your one knee on your other. So the Try to cross your legs completely and bring your both knees in a straight line. So push it in. Yes. So this is the Gomukhasana stretch. You have to keep your feet on the side. So try not to sit on the snow like this. So try to keep it, cross it and try to keep your both hips on the ground. Don't lift here like this. So try to sit Yes, so this is the cow face pose. It looks like a face of cow. Now, slowly take your right hand up and left hand down. Try to lock your hands backside, open your chest and take deep inhalation and exhalation as much as possible. Now, take your right hand up. So your right leg yeah, so keep your right leg up and take your right hand up. Yeah, good. And hard breath, you, you have to change your hands. Ah, yes. Take deep inhalation and exhalation. Close your eyes. Complete awareness on the stretch. Try to lock it backside. Uh, Jasmine, man, your left hand should be going down here. Yeah, and try to touch your palms, fingers together. Open your chest, open your shoulder, deep inhalation and exhalation. Feel the expansion and contraction. So this helps to give complete stretch for your right lung. It helps to open your right side of your lung. And it gives good stretch and expansion to your spinal cord. That helps to gain more energy. You can hold more oxygen to your body. Now, inhale and exhale. Slowly release your pose, release your hands and release your legs. Now, switch your legs. Take your right leg in and keep your left leg up. So cross your leg completely. Try to cross it well and try to bring your both knees in a straight line. Yes, now take your left hand up and take your right hand down. 
try to lock your hands now slowly open stretch your hand back open your chest and look straight now close your eyes feel the stretch take aware on your body and take deep inhalation and exhalation one two feel the stretch feel the complete opening of your chest muscles so now your left left lung get stretched well so deep inhale and exhale Now deep inhale and exhale. One more deep inhale and exhale. Slowly release your hands and relax. Release your legs. Slowly stretch your legs and relax yourself. Just listen your body and breathing. So you may feel the complete expansion and contraction of your uh, stomach muscles. You may feel the free flow in your breathing. Yes. Now slowly move to the standing stretches. Hold your legs on your toes and go to standing. Completely relax your whole body. Now let's move to the Tadasana Kriya. If you complete stretch for your whole body, take your toes together, exhale completely. Inhale, rise your arms up. Exhale down. Along your heels. Inhale, rise your heel and arms up. Stretch it up. Fully exhale down. Inhale and exhale. Feel the relaxation of your body muscles after each and every exhalation. Inhale and exhale. Last round. Inhale. And exhale, relax yourself. Now, let's move to the back. Arch, Arda Chakra, then open your legs. So you have to keep your feet to your shoulder level, or you can keep it to your mat level. Take your hands on your lower back, so just give support like this. Now, so don't keep your elbows here. Try to open it. So stretch your elbows. Open your chest. Exhale completely. Inhale. Exhale. Slowly stretch back. Take your tummy forward. Look back. Try to stretch back as much as possible without training your, uh, training your body. Feel the stretch. Extend your stomach. Extend your chest. And five seconds, keep breathing. One, two, three, four, five. Inhale up and exhale. Go to half forward. Extend your spine. Keep your both hands on your chin bone. Keep your uh, spine extending and deep inhale and exhale. Now, one more deep inhalation. While exhaling slowly, extend your spine and move down. Completely fall down forward. Try to touch the ground. Keep your knees slightly bent. That reduce the uh, hamstring strain. So try to bring your stomach and chest close to your thighs. Keep your spine expanded. 
and drop your head down try to bring your head towards your toes sit down keep breathing exhale completely inhale again go to half forward the right hand will pose extend your spine keep your spine expanding now inhale raise your arms up and exhale relax relax yourself completely within your body and breathing yes now let us move to a uh, uh, small plant series so with the cobra so start from front side of your yoga mat keep your spine straight exhale completely inhale raise your arms up fully stretch your body up pull your body up feel your wrist and raise your arms up your whole body exhale slowly extend your spine and move your body down the father has started now inhale step up back to the plank so don't arch your back make the perfect plank now exhale slowly take your body down so completely lie down like a vipri the china city exhale completely inhale slowly take your move your body to cobra arch your back open your chest and stretch back exhale slowly take your body down to break a china city now toes on the tippy toes and do pressure for your hands and slowly move to the mountain now slowly bring your legs forward forward bending extend your spine exhale completely now inhale raise your arms up pull your body up and exhale relax yes so slowly slowly increase the speed in our uh, third round so again the same way inhale upright raise your arms up pull your body up exhale extend your spine and move down inhale step back and move to the plank exhale completely take your body down in chaturanga dandasana and all over keep your vipreeta shayana sthiti inhale cobra open your chest open your shoulders and stretch back exhale down check your shoulder and just your knee here and slowly move to the mountain extend your spine Inhale, head up, and exhale. Walk forward and go to the forward bending. Find the hastasan. Inhale, extend your spine and raise your arms up, and exhale, relax. Yes. Now two more rounds. Inhale, raise your arms up, pull your body up. exhale go to forward bending extend your spine keep your slightly bend your knee 
and bring your stomach to your thighs. Yes, correct your posture. Now, inhale, step back to plank. Exhale, Chaturanga Dandasan. Slowly drop your body completely on the ground with the support of your hands. Yes. Inhale, Cobra. Exhale, down. Again, slowly push up and go to the mountain pose. So this is the arm strengthening. We are practicing this as the arm strengthening. Yes. Now inhale, head up, exhale, walk forward to Padahastasan. Inhale, extend your spine and rise your body up. Exhale, position. Yeah. But don't lift your heel when you are stretching up. Yeah. Now, last round, inhale up, rise your arms, exhale forward, inhale plank, step back, exhale chaturangi, build your arms, inhale cobra, Open your chest, shoulders. Exhale slowly down. Drop your body down. Now inhale and exhale. Move to mountain. Yes. Inhale, head up. Exhale, walk forward. Walk, walk forward, walk forward. Padhastasana. Inhale, up stretch, hands up. Exhale, position. Relax yourself. Yes. Let's move to um, lying down pose for chest opening, asanas. Sit down. Slowly stretch your legs. Leave your spine on the ground with the support of your elbows and lie down. Spread your legs, go to Shavasan. Take your hands away from your body. Close your eyes, relax your body and breathe. Take deep inhalation and exhalation. Relax your left leg. Relax your right leg. Relax your upper body. Relax your left hand. Relax your right hand. Relax your neck and the head. Completely relax. Now, so this move to the Bujapada Pidasan. <coughs> Take your feet together, take your hands close to your body. Completely relax your whole body. Now slowly fold your both legs in. Open your feet. So spread your both feet to your, uh, to your mat level. Exhale completely. Keep your hands close to your feet. Exhale completely. Inhale, rise your hips up as much as possible. Slowly squeeze your shoulders back. Take your hands in and interlock your fingers and rise your hips up. So, Ardha Chakrasana. Stay there, keep breathing. So, push the ground and rise your hips up as much as possible. 
Your chin is automatically locked to your chest by rising your body. Stay there, keep breathing, try to make deep inhale and exhale. One, continue, inhale and exhale. Rise it up, rise it up. Inhale and exhale. For three more breaths, try to make deep inhale and exhale. Take away on your breathing. Feel the expansion and contraction. Deep inhale and exhale. Take one more breath. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Slowly release your back. Gradually drop your body down. Release your fingers. Take your body down. Upper back, middle back, lower back. And release your pose. Slowly stretch your legs and relax. Relax yourself completely. Take deep inhale and exhale. Now let us move to the Machyasan fish pose. Take your feet together, take your hands close to your body. So try to make Padmasan or Ardha Padmasan. Right feet on your left thigh and left feet on your right thigh. So Padmasana. If you, if you feel difficult to arch your back, you can use block or pillow. So stretch your uh, legs down. Slowly take support of your elbows here or take support of your hands here. Slowly arch your back and keep your upper head on the ground. And slowly raise your hands and hold your toes. If you feel difficult, then you can use the block for your middle back. For your middle back. So that helps to give complete arching your body. If you can't do Padmasana, you can do Ardha Padmasana. One feet on your other side. And slowly arch your back. Open your shoulders. Open your chest, throat completely. Feel the complete stretching in your abdominal area. Deep inhalation and exhalation. Inhale deeply and exhale completely. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. If you feel difficult, you can release your pose at any time. Don't strain yourself. Now slowly release your pose. Take support of your elbows or take support of your hands. And slowly release your body up. Yes. Relax your legs and go to lying down. We we'll make a counter pose for the Machyasan. So when we are doing Machyasan, if we breath more, we get more expansion in our lung. Completely relax yourself. Now take your feet together. This is the counter for both back stretches. Inhale, interlock your fingers and stretch your hands up. Exhale, hug your knees. Push your both uh, eyes towards your stomach and chest. Exhale completely, inhale and exhale slowly rise your head up. Stay there, keep breathing. 
Yes, try to bring your chin or your nose to your knees. Try not to rise your body up and don't strain your neck region. Push your thighs completely um, to your chest and gently rise your head up. Be breathing within your shallow inhalation and exhalation. Now, inhale completely. Inhale slowly, stretch your hand and legs. Exhale, relax. So, relax yourself completely. So, now we are going to practice the chakrasan, the advanced back stretch, back strengthening stretch. It helps to give complete opening for our lungs. We try to make deep breathing in the chakrasan. That helps to give complete opening for our lungs. It helps to hold oxygen for long time. All the time, alveoles of our lungs. So let us start. If you feel difficult, you can do artha chakrasan. Again, fold your legs and rising your hips up. So fold your legs. Check your both. Feet separately to your mat level. Yes, open your legs. Your knees are facing the ceiling. Don't keep like this. We have to open this. Keep your back completely flat on the ground. Take your both hands close to your shoulders. Fingers are facing inside. Fingers are facing your shoulders. So make your hands strong. Keep your hands strong and gently fold your fingers a little bit. That gives good, good grip to balance your body. Exhale completely. Inhale slowly, rise your hips up and bring the elbows. Exhale. Inhale. Slowly stretch it out. And stay here. Keep with your elbows fully. And stretch your arms. Slowly take your body towards your head. Stretch your body. That gives complete opening for your chest. If you feel difficult, you can release your body anytime. Don't strain yourself. Now, slowly release your body down. Release your hands and release your legs. Relax yourself completely. Lie down in Shavasana. Spread your legs. Take your hands away from your body. Relax your whole body. Open your heartbeat. Now take deep inhale and exhale. Yes. Move to the second round of Chakrasan. Fold your legs. Open your feet. Come on. So Chakrasan is extreme lung opening asana. It helps to relieve your back muscles. Yes, take your hands close to your shoulder. Exhale completely. Make your hands strong, palms strong. Inhale, rise your hip up and slowly stretch your elbows and try to stretch up. Straighten your elbows, try to, yes. Slowly give half weight for your hands, little more weight. Take your body little back and take deep inhale and exhale. Yeah, slowly relax, release your posture, relax, Kripa. No, 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 you should not, not, not like that. So lie down on your flat back. You should keep your hands like this. So your fingers are facing inside. So try to rise your, if you feel difficult, first try to practice the Ardha Chakrasana. Okay. Half feel. Then you push and rise your body up. Yes. 
Kind of relax yourself, stretch your legs, completely relax. So we can practice this chakrasana even two to three minutes as a stretch. That gives the complete relaxation and complete opening of our upper body part, the internal organs and back muscles. Now slowly, gently hug your knees. And stay here. So relax your whole body, relax your back, relax your shoulders. Inhale and exhale. Gently move your, uh, roll your back here and there, right side and left side. Just roll it, relax your back, do massage to your spinal cord. Now move front and back here. Your spine, yes, and relax yourself. Now, let's move to the sitting stretcher. Sitting asanas, hold your like slowly turn on your right side, push with your left hand, and come to a sitting position. Yes. Relax yourself within your body and breathing. Take deep inhale and exhale. So we are going to practice the back stretch asana, the beautiful ushtrasana to stretch and strengthening again our chest, lungs and the throat region. So before that we do complete relaxation for our back. So sit in Vajrasana. Sitting Vajrasana, open your both knees, little bit, open your both knees, that helps you do deep breathing when doing the Shishankhasan, yes, exhale completely, inhale, rise your arms up, pull your body up, exhale, slowly stretch, slowly bend down, Extend your spine, so don't hunch your back, try to extend it, sit back. If your hip is not touching your heel, use pillow or block on back side. So slowly try to keep your elbow down, keep your elbow down and take your head down. Relax yourself completely. Listen your body and breathing. Feel the calmness of your body and breathing. So touch your both arms, elbow on the ground. Feel the stretch, feel the relaxation. Keep your forehead down. Listen your breathing from the rabbit coat. Feel the movement of inhalation and exhalation in your back. Feel the expansion and contraction of your back muscles, the spinal spine muscles. Exhale completely. Now inhale, slowly rise your arms up and relax. So this is the relaxing pose. Relax yourself. Gently roll your shoulders. One, two, three. And reverse. Three, two, one and relax yourself okay then come on your knees so we are going to practice first 
are the ustrasans. Take your right leg, friends. To maintain your leg in perfect right angle, so don't stretch your like this or don't stretch fully like this. So you should maintain a perfect right angle here, and although your right knee and your toes it should be around uh, 30 degree or something. So don't keep it straight here. You can't balance, and don't keep it away like this. So try to keep it just around a 30 degree, 35 or something. That's enough. So keep your toe or feet flat. If you are not flexible, if your back is not flexible, you can use your toes, tippy toes. So this is depends upon your flexibility. So take your hands here, exhale completely. Inhale, raise your um, left arm up. Open your left arm and try to touch your ankle. Left ankle. Now slowly raise your right arm. Look at your right tippy fingers and slowly stretch it back as much as possible. So this will be support you. This will be try to open your chest. So try to stretch, pull it up, pull your body all over and back. Feel the stretch and keep breathing within your breathing. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Stay there. Inhale and exhale. Inhale. Now, slowly release your force. Inhale, take your left hand up and exhale down. Now, switch your side. Keep your right knee down and left feet front. Exhale completely. Toes on the tippy toes are flat. That is depends upon your uh, stretching level. Exhale completely. Inhale, right arm up. And exhale, hold your ankle. Inhale, left arm up. Look at your left, left finger, and slowly stretch, stretch, stretch. Try to open your chest and stretch back as much you can. Don't strain yourself. Keep breathing within your movement of breath. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Yes. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Now, exhale completely. Inhale, slowly release. And exhale, relax. Now, sit on, on your knees. Yes. Let's move to your both uh, hands stretching back the complete ushtrasana. If you feel difficult, keep your hands on your hip and stretch back. Or you can take wall support. So, yeah, I'll show you from here. So touch your toes, so just touch your toes on the wall like this, exhale completely. So inhale, raise your arms up, take your hands back and slowly stretch your body back as much as possible. Bend your elbows and try to drop your hands down slowly, slowly. So from here, first stretch here. So this itself you good. Uh, opening for your chest. In Ushtrasana, you should not take your body here. So you have to extend your, uh, stretch your stomach front. So slowly, slowly push your stomach front and move down. Stay there, just listen your breathing, listen your Short inhalation and exhalation. Already your chest get completely open. 
we can't make deep or something don't try to be, uh, take deep inhalation and exhalation in Ushrasana. Yes, just three to five breaths straighter and come back. Inhale and relax. Yes. Relax yourself. And move to the counter pose. Sit in Vajrasan. Vajrasan Yoga Mudra. Sit in Vajrasan. Take your both hands together. So lock your hands back side here like this. Exhale completely. Inhale. Extend your spine. And slowly move your body down. Keep your stomach, chest, and down. So try don't lift your hands up. Arm should be on the uh, on your back. Just lock and bend down. So feel the relaxation on your back, the spine, spinal cord. You should feel the stretch and relaxation on your middle and lower part of your back. Just listen your body and breathing. So try to sit on your feet. Don't rise your hips up like this. Sit down. Your buttocks should touch in your feet. And then completely. Inhale slowly, release your pose. And exhale, raise your hands and relax yourself. Relax completely. Slowly release your pose, stretch your legs and relax. Now. Just move to the pranayam practice. Sit in comfortable meditative asana, padmasan, ardha padmasan, vajrasan, or whatever. Siddhasan, or whatever. Yes. Keep your hands in mudra. Completely relax your whole body. Close your eyes, relax yourself, feel the stretch which done by you, feel the stretch on your chest, stomach, you feel the stretchings on your back muscles, just absorb the expression of your body, you may feel, may not feel, just you absorb your body. If you feel any stretchings in your body muscles, mentally relax it. Mentally feel the relaxation of that particular part. Now we are being in relaxed mode. Completely relaxed. Now let us move to the Nadi Shuddhi Pranayama. So take your hands in Nashika Mudra, right hand, fold your index finger and the snake finger. Yes. Close your thumb. Left nostril deep, inhale. Fold your left nostril and right nostril complete, exhale. Right nostril deep, inhale. Hold your right nostril and left nostril complete, exhale. Left inhale. Right exhale. 
write in here left exhale Patrick, use your right hand. Yeah. So start from left inhalation, left deep inhale, right complete exhale. Right deep inhale. Left complete exhale. So feel the free flow of your breathing. Feel the movement of air. Feel the drink. Air drawn to your lungs. Inhale and exhale alternate. Exhale through your left nostril and relax. Feel the complete calmness of your body and breathing. Relax completely. Feel the energy flow in your body. Feel the breath flow. Feel the complete relaxation of all your pancha koshas, the physical body, pranic body, mind body, mental body, the intellect body, and the bliss body. Feel the complete relaxation. Feel the calmness. Relax completely, slowly rub your palms. With no gentle maturation for your face. Interlock your fingers, stretch your hands, take deep inhale. Exhale, bend down. Inhale and relax. And the Namaskar. Aum Shanti 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 Hare Krishna. Thanks, Manju.